all you beautiful Aquarius. I hope you guys are having a good day or night wherever you may be on this planet we reside in. Today's video is going to be your December 2018 reading and whatever messages Spirit would like me to relate to you guys. Keep in mind that readings are general, so messages may or may not resonate with you. If they don't, kick them to the curb because they're not for you. If they do, let me know down in the comments. Give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. Well, that was quick. All right, Spirit, what lovely messages do you have for my Aquarius? What messages do you have for my Aquarius for the month of December? I'm moving forward. We got three major arcanas so far. This is crazy. One last message, please. One last card, Spirit. What else do you have for the lovely Aquarius? What other messages? One more card, please. We got two cycle cards here. All right. So we've got the Knight of Wands. This could be you or somebody you're dealing with, but somebody here is very passionate about a situation. Might be very passionate about, um, I'm really getting this is somebody you're dealing with or connecting with. Um, so very passionate about this other person or they're very passionate about you um but a lot of passions offers of passions but with the devil card here i'm getting kind of obsession um uh, maybe it's lustful i mean wands are all about passion so this might be very lustful kind of like one night stand type thing um but they're very obsessive, very lustful energy I'm getting here. Um, with the world card, this is a cycle. This is something that needed to happen, something um, that is a, a karmic cycle. And then we have the death card here, which is the ending of cycles. So I, th I feel like you're going to move forward with the chariot card here. You're going to move forward away from this person because you're going to realize that, you know, it is an unhealthy obsession with the devil card here. And it is all just about lust um, with this knight of wands. I'm getting, yeah, I'm just getting a very lustful energy here. Um, but I feel as if you are going to realize that this is just a cycle and a lesson that needed to be learned and you are going to end it and move forward with your life and move forward with, you know, finding somebody that is more stable and is looking for an actual commitment more than just, you know, uh, a, a booty call. I mean, <laughs> just being blunt here, but this is, this has booty call written all over it. What the... That would be the washer downstairs, making the, the floor rumble. That was, okay. Okay. Threw me off a little bit. But yeah, okay. So I'm just getting a very obsessive, lustful energy here. You know, somebody, maybe this is you that's the booty call, or maybe you're, you're calling the booty call person. But either way, one of you is going to break it off because it is a karmic lesson, and it is a cycle that needed to be learned, and you're going to move forward with finding somebody more you know emotionally stable looking for a long-term commitment here let's get some clarifiers why is this knight of wands here please spirit why is this knight of wands here why is the knight of wands here Nine 
nine of pentacles. Oh, okay. Um, so my first, <laughs> um, my first thought that popped into my head with this was hooker. So I don't know. Somebody out there is paying for hookers. I don't know who that message is for, but yeah, somebody is definitely paying for some, um, passion. <laughs> Somebody paying for some passion here. <laughs> All right, why is this chariot card here, spirit, please? This is kind of a kinky reading, not gonna lie. Why is this chariot card here? Why is the chariot card here, spirit? Too many. Why is the chariot card? Okay, actually, no, they're telling me to leave that in reverse. Okay, I don't usually read reversals unless my guides tell me that I need to. In this case, they did. So, moving forward from this person because the teamwork's not there. You know, this isn't a family situation. This isn't long-term. This isn't, you know, stability-wise. And that's why you're choosing to move forward is because, yeah, um, this isn't somebody you want to have a family with. This isn't somebody you see yourself having a family with or being in a long-term commitment with. This is literally just, you know, a night full of passion, a booty call. In somebody's case, a hooker or two. Either way, take what resonates and leave the rest with that. All right, why is this death card here, spirit? Why is this death card here? Why is the death card here, spirit? Please clarify the death card. This might not need clarified. It might just be, you know, you realize that it's a cycle and it needs to end, you know? Maybe you just realize that, you know, it's unhealthy and you, you choose to end it. Yeah, they're not, they're not wanting a clarifier for the death card. So yeah, you're choosing to end this cycle. You're choosing to end this, this booty call thing. Uh, maybe in the hooker's case, you're choosing to s stop that. Either way, it's the end of cycles. So, in one way or another, you're ending it. <laughs> Clarify this world card, please, spirit. Why is this world card here? Why is this world card here? Why is the world card here? Oh, I also got, um, yeah, I just heard if you're currently in a relationship and this is the thing, um, whoever you're connecting with is the one, um, that's either having an affair or cheating with a hooker. I don't know. If you're in a relationship, I just got that message. So, uh, clarifying the world here is Six of Cups. So, this is past life karma. Um, yeah, that, that's the main message I'm getting from this is it is a past life karma. You know, we build up karma for ourselves, you know, over countless past lives that we've had. And when it's time to be healed and, you know, faced, 
it can present itself in this life and that's what's happening you know i've i've dealt with a lot of you know karma in this life from some of my past lives so yeah what i'm getting with that is you know end of cycles you know ending of karmic cycles and this is from definitely from a past life with the six of cups here why is the devil card here okay okay eight of wands so, de yeah, communication is coming through, you know, communication of telling the person, or, yeah, telling the person that you're ending this, you're ending this relation, can you call it a relationship? I mean, if you are in a relationship and they're the person that's having an affair or cheating, then you find out about it and you're, you choose to end it. You're communicating with them that you're choosing to end this. Either way, this is communication about ending the cycle. Okay, I'm going to pull one card for Spirit's advice for you in the month of December. This may or may not have anything to do with the actual reading. It's just whatever Spirit wants you to know at this time. I'm going to give this a couple shuffles here and then pick a card. Spirit, what is your advice for the lovely Aquarius for the month of December? What advice do you have for my Aquarius? What advice do you have for my Aquarius? All right, let's see here. Wand intention. Okay, so with this, what I'm picking up, it doesn't actually have to do with your reading. Um, it's just set your intentions right now. Set what you want your goals to be. Set um, set up where you see yourself, you know, in 10 years or five years or in a year, whatever it may be, you know, set goals and picture and visualize where you want to be, you know, a month from now, a year from now, whatever. Just really visualize where you want to be. So that is your December 2018 reading. I hope you resonated with it. If you do, let me know down in the comments. Give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. Mwah! Much love to all you guys.